The following contest is scheduled as a six-man tag match. Introducing first, it is the team of the Posse and Marco Stunt. This has been a crazy story the last couple of weeks where AEW star and Olive Branch's own Marco Stunt came out to confront his friend, Walker Hayes, whom he went to high school with. Yeah, I had no idea, first of all, that Walker was from Olive Branch. Many and, of us uh, didn't know that. Second, I didn't know that him and Marco were friends because uh, they don't seem like the likely duo. They, they don't, but that this is not the Walker Hayes that we all knew previously. This is the remnant of Walker Hayes. The remnant of Walker Hayes has been coming out here consistently, so I don't even remember and they literally what he was like before. abducted Marco Stunt, put ether in his face, put him in a burlap sack, and took him out of here. Thank, yeah. Thank goodness for the posse. We're lucky that Marco didn't come back, the reverend of Marco Stunt. Oh, boy. And interesting here. next, their opponents. It is the team of Jackson and Otis, the Crowleys, and the Revenant of Walker Hayes, the Hollywood Horror Show. These guys are absolutely disgusting. They are as nasty as it gets. And Marco Stunt tried to talk some sense into the Revenant of Walker Hayes. Oh, that's a face only a mother could love. You know, I don't even think their mothers love them. That's probably what their problem is. And here we are, trios tag team action here on Memphis Wrestling. Thank you so much for joining us. This one should be action packed and as exciting as it gets. Jimmy Blaylock is nothing but trouble. He's gonna be ringside. That's a total of seven people here at the ring, and you saw the hellacious fight at the desk last week. There's no telling what we're gonna see in this match. Referee, good luck on this. One man <laughs> yeah. in the ring to start. There should be a couple of refs out here. Looks like Jackson Crowley sitting Indian style in the center of the ring, legs folded. Hit Marco's not used to this. Well, now Marco does perform in the land of the Giants on AEW Dynamite and AEW. Yeah, Rampage. but he's not used to some weirdo with the pig mask sitting in the middle of the ring, Indian style. Good point. But he is used to going against guys their size. But look at like Walker Hayes just towers. And even the Jackson Crowley, taller, bigger. But this is nothing new to Marco's stunt. Marco, uh, he's still got his fanny pack in the ring. Well, <laughs> he did. He did, Dustin. Until Jack Sin took it. I think we've started this match. I'm not sure about the fanny pack. Marco Stud hoisted like a championship belt. And we are underway. Big Huracan Rana by Marco Stunt. Mr. Fun Size himself. Quicker than a hiccup. I stole that. Yeah, uh, I, uh, I, laughed on, I laughed on the inside. Marco Stunt, very unique offense. Because he's so tiny, he's able to do unique things. Another big Huracan Rana. The he man might be knows. tiny, but he is skilled. He knows his way around the ring. Now it's two on one. Oh. Big feet to the face of the and, Revenant. And Walker didn't like that too He's much. He's looking over here at us. I know. And we have a standoff in the center of the ring. All six men and monsters. We can rewind several weeks. Just throws him, throws him at the Hollywood Horror Show. There's unique offense for you. But if we rewind a couple of weeks back, without Hollywood Jimmy Blaylock, the Crowleys and the Revenant of Walker Hayes cut Simon's hair and they've been feeding off of it somehow. Fans, the action will continue. Don't you dare go away. 
Sunday, October 17th, Memphis Wrestling gets extreme. The innovator of violence, Tommy Dreamer, is coming to Memphis Wrestling. Get your tickets right now at championshipwrestlingmemphis.com. Welcome to Sonic. May I take your order? One grape cheeseburger. I'm on it. Grape cheeseburger, almost ready. On my way. Someone pass me the crepe sauce. Almost ready on the burger. One Sonic crepe cheeseburger. Pro Shingle is a professional roofing company that specializes in complete roof replacement and speedy shingle service for small repairs with no waiting. It's the simple choice. Call Pro Shingle today, 901 258 6503. Need a new fit and a fresh pair of kicks? Thrifty Man has new and pre owned, like new items just for you. 2235 Covington Pike, Thrifty Man, where men can dress nice for a low price. Back to Memphis Wrestling. Big clothesline by Lil Chris. Tags his brother, his partner Simon in. Want to talk about tag team continuity? Doesn't get any better than this. <laughs> Marco Stunt wants in on the fun. Well, give it to him. And again, <laughs> there's the cover. Two count. Jackson got a little too close for Simon's comfort. Lil Chris with a blind tag coming in on behalf of the posse. Looks like more tag team. <laughs> Using Simon as a springboard. Hey, look, Marco fits in with him great. Absolutely. <laughs> Simon blows him down. One, two. Looks like Jackson just in time grabs the ankle. Oh, there's a tag. And you can see how cautious Simon is being. He knows the dirty tactics of the Hollywood Jimmy Blaylock. And Simon wants some of that hair. After cutting his hair, he is trying to rip <laughs> Jackson's hair out. Look, I think I, I know I do have a hair phobia. I don't like other people's hair. Big sidewalk slam. Almost so, got him. The point of me saying that is really grossing me out that they're touching each other's hair like that. Well, Simon is trying to pull Jackson's hair out by the roots. Well, that sounds painful. After cutting his hair several weeks back, that's what they deserve. Marco goes for a cover near fall. Just a one count, though. Marco's like a little bulldog, man. Just ferocious, even at his size. I was thinking Chihuahua, but well, it's like a bulldog will work too. Well, his bite is much bigger than a Chihuahua. I don't know. There's some oh. little. <laughs> nah, you so got a point there. Yeah, never mind. <laughs> Jackson Crowley is in control. Goes for the cover. Marco Stunt says not yet. And there's no tag there. There was no tag behind the referee's back. Otis is in the ring now. Drops an elbow on the knee of Lil Chris. Talk about having trouble lately. Lil Chris still suffering from a sore elbow and back. Now it looks like he's going to have to worry about his knees as well as Otis has Lil Chris tied up like a pretzel. Marco Stunt on the sideline, getting the fans involved. Trying to get the momentum shifted here. Little Chris still in deep trouble. Be sure to tweet at us wherever you're watching at CW30 Wrestling on Twitter, Instagram, even Facebook. Share with us, join in on the conversation, and be sure to subscribe on YouTube youtube.com slash championship wrestling as the revenant of Walker Hayes right in your living room just pounding little Chris swipes at Marco and 
the referee <laughs> literally takes Marco off his feet, holding him back. Mm. Referee's losing control of this one yeah. fast, and we knew he would with so many people involved. Well, and you know what? Surprisingly, Jimmy Blaylock's been real quiet over there. He's actually been a good boy at ringside. I wouldn't go that far, but. So far. He's been a little qu too quiet. The revenant of Walker Hayes. Longtime friends with Marco Stunt. Marco, several weeks back, tried to talk some sense into Walker, but to no avail. Why? Look at him. No, I mean, why did he just do that to little Chris with the referee center right there, number one, and number two? Well, well okay, anyway. so let's rephrase your question. Why is he doing this? <laughs> why do they do anything that they exactly. do? Exactly. <laughs> I don't even think they know that a pinfall wins the match. There's Lil Chris. He doesn't, he doesn't want to dance. Well, since Jimmy Blaylock has taken them and mushed their brains, they don't know how to win. Little Chris needs that tag, and he's got it to Marco Stunt. They just do what they're told. More unique offense from Mr. Fun Size. Jackson Crowley caught with an elbow right to the nose. Elbow drop to the back. Marco Stunt heating up. Tell me that's a Chihuahua's clothesline. <laughs> and here's the revenant of Look, Walker Hayes. There are some a-hole Chihuahuas out there, okay? I don't know if you can say ah! it on TV, but big code breaker. I didn't say the word. I Marco Stunt. And he said it again. Because you can say that. What are they setting up for here? No. Canadian yes. Destroyer! Yes. Big kick. Marco to the corner. Big cutter on top of Otis. One, two, three. He got him. That's it. Ladies and gentlemen, your winners of this match, Simon and Chris the Pussy and Marco there are your winners, ladies and gentlemen. The Posse and Margo Stunt get the job done here against the Hollywood Horror Show and the Memphis Wrestling fans love it. We would take a look at that. Hold on just a second. The Horror Show are not done. We've seen this before. Chloroform. Ether, whatever you want to call it, I smell it. And Marco's yet to turn around. Oh no. Jimmy Blaylock doesn't want any of this. You smell that, Maria? I'm, not, I'm holding my breath. Oh my goodness. Marco's got him. Punch his lights out, Marco. <laughs> yeah. And he does! I've been waiting a long time. All of Memphis has been waiting for that. To see Jimmy Blaylock get punched out. And he's gonna do it again. Not so fast, the revenant of Walker Hayes. Down goes Marco. The Posse and Marco Stunt have picked up the victory, but doesn't look like they're oh gonna God. win the war! Oh, no. why? The resurrection why? of Walker Hayes has just demolished Marco Stunt and the Posse. This is absolute madness, fans. Don't go away. We'll be right back. Get them out of there. <laughs>